It's a home like no other we've ever been invited to. Welcome to Celine Dion's jaw-dropping estate. You're a huge Celine Dion fan, right? Oh yeah, every night, listen to her before I go to bed. So. <laughs> When we first heard we were going to get into Celine Dion's house, there were several women producers in the unit who were huge Celine Dion fans who were like near tears when they heard that this was happening. And it turned out that like the schedule didn't work out for any of them. And it's like the last two guys standing are... When you get into a house, you're really getting inside the private life of the owner. Celine Dion is one of the most reclusive, elusive, richest pop stars on the planet. Here we were in her world, in her bedroom. What you learn about Celine by being in her house is that everything is meticulous. It's all about the details. Every piece of furniture, every light fixture. She was so obsessed with symmetry and beauty that she had one stairwell on the right and a stairwell on the left to match that just went into a wall. It was a stairway to nowhere. And, but that was just because symmetry and aesthetics and beauty and art form is so important to her. Having had never filmed a house before, I didn't really know what to expect. And it was just so big. The, the house was so massive. I you mean, hear a house is an understatement. Yeah, this yeah, is complex, a, an complex. Estate, a complex, yes. a compound. It's ginormous. This house sinks. And the funny thing is we were talking about the closet and we're like, we're guys, we're not really going to be all that into our closet. We get in there, we're like, wow. It's like spaceship meets dry cleaner meets pop diva and it's like, it's crazy. The wow for me was probably the genetically engineered grass, which didn't the even grass? make... The grass? The grass was cool. <laughs> Who's looking at the grass? This place has like a 450,000 gallon water park. Well, I think the biggest thing we did was send Ray inside the pool with the GoPro camera. Yeah, I was executive producer and underwater camera guy. I'm in my bathing suit shooting with GoPros all over the pool. You'll see some of those shots in the show. I also wore a GoPro down a water slide, which freaked you out. Well, it was terrifying. I mean, the if you suit a or no. <laughs> it was like hearing a banshee scream. <laughs> when Ray was going down this one slide, and I didn't, I thought he was hurt. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna have to go. That slide looked so truly awesome that I, I just had to go down. In this case, my bathing suit was my suit. I didn't bother changing. I just Superman right into the thing, and as I, as I was going down, lesson learned, if you're wearing a suit on a water slide, it slows you down. Hey CNBC fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you're going to find videos packed with all of the information that you need to be smarter about your finances. You can subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me or the I right here to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.